We're gonna review a site now submitted by Devananda. I really hope I am saying that right. Website is called Beaufort Construction. Gotta assume it's a construction oriented site. Goals of this site is to inform clients about the services they offer, present their portfolio, encourage users to contact them via the form at the footer and move forward with the sale. Let's check it out. Okay, the serif fonts where it says like, guided by integrity, we specialize in design. They are really uh, making this much more busier than it needs to be. The part where you actually see the building is actually faded by this gradient in the background. And it's like, I want to look at the image, but I have all this uh, complex designing like text kind of fighting over it. I have this gradient fighting over it. This top banner area would be much better served by clearly see the building and then clearly see that title and then all the other text I would just put down below the banner altogether. The navigation is really clear. If I come to this site, I know how to navigate it instantly, so that's really good. But let's scroll down. I wanna see actually things that they've done and then if you say a heritage of integrity and then you have an awesome building, that to me speaks way more than the, this designy um, B, C, I, and then trying to explain to me what integrity means. I'll keep coming down. This text over here, very, very small. Another font happening here. <laughs> Way too many fonts. I love to use one font if I can at different weights. Um, if you're gonna use more than one font, I would say I would not, unless you really know what you're doing, go beyond two or three fonts, just to be safe. There's just too many fonts going on in this site. We have boats, we have a bridge. I'm really having this big hunger to see what Beaufort actually has done. Scrolling down here. Again, I'm not a fan of even more fonts being used. At least now I can have a an idea, a really clear idea of something they've built. And so I like this. Uh, coming down from here, ooh, I like it again. We're seeing more of the client's work. This is great. Uh, not a fan of this gradient. This is a blurry image right here. I like the shot. I like the layout, everything. I want it clear. I want clear images. But maybe the client doesn't have clear images. So sometimes you have to work with what you're given. I don't know the services that they offer. I don't know if they do everything, commercial, any residential at all. I feel like it's missing um, that goal. I'm gonna look at their portfolio real quick. The best thing you could do online is to hire a good photographer and take really good images of your work because that is what's gonna sell it online. Not really digging these images. Scroll down, let's view this. Too much movement happening. I don't like all the movement. Be yeah, this is... <laughs> Another goal of this website, encourage users to contact them via the form at the footer and move forward with the sale. I would say it's not apparent that this is a form. I don't see input fields. Are you ready for high quality results? I'll click on it. Commercial, what's your name? Nick. What's your email address? That phone number, one, two, three. Do you have plans already? No. This form I, I feel is kind of discouraging. Clear high quality images of things that they built. To me, that is what's gonna be the most powerful thing in as far as presenting value on this page. I feel like it has all the right elements. It's just the way these elements are being presented, I feel like needs a lot of rework. I can tell a lot of uh, effort was being put into choosing all the fonts, the font sizes, font colors, but really a lot of that is just complicating the page and to me unnecessary and it's distracting from the real value which is construction and seeing their construction and seeing what people have to say about it to me that is what should be foremost and the text and fonts and colors need to take a back seat and put those high quality images in the front seat for this site if you like these web design videos um where i review random websites Please click subscribe down below the red button and uh, keep watching. Thank you.